Can the nationally significant entomology collections, the insect collections at Tully House, help us to save bumblebees? Well, Tully House is currently involved in a national collaboration led by Imperial College London and the Natural History Museum, and we're investigating how several species of bumblebees have changed over 100 years. So why do this? Well, bumblebees are vital pollinators. They help to pollinate many of our, they're vital to help us to pollinate many of our crops and our food on our plate. And without them, we'll have severe food shortages. So it's really important to help to conserve them. And this research will help us to understand how they are changing and why some species are declining more than others. There are two lines of research. We've had researchers come up here to take really high detailed resolution images. And then from those images, we can use clever techniques to measure changes in wing length and other aspects of body shape and how this has changed over 100 years. The other line of research looks into the DNA of bumblebees and how it's changing. So DNA or the genetic code determines how an animal grows and develops and even how it, how it continues to function. So we are using the Natural History Museum's labs to piece together the, the really old and fragmented DNA and from this, we can build a, build a picture up, a really good picture, to see how bumblebees have changed over 100 years. And we can look into the code to see how certain parts have changed more than others. And if there's any correlation to the environment, and in particular, how we've changed and, and impacted on the environment. So we're now uh, taking the middle leg from the bumblebee very gently with these forceps and holding the pin in the other hand so we don't damage the specimen. Now I'm sealing the, the middle leg in, um, in this small container, which will protect it from contamination. It's being labeled with a specimen number, a unique code. The specimen um, tube will now be sent off to the Natural History Museum labs, where we will piece together the fragmented DNA as part of the research. So the Tully House collections have 18 species of bumblebees in our in our collections and they represent the outstanding biodiversity in Cumbria um, and Cumbria is particularly important for biodiversity it has more it has a greater range of habitats than any other English county um, and also there is abundance of, of natural parks and spaces too as well so it, so Cumbria will be a vital comparator for the rest of, of the UK